Hi everyone, and welcome to our CQL Pro video tutorial series. In this video, we're going to learn how to print full bleed on the QL850 printer using CQL Pro advanced labeling software. Full bleed printing is when you print from one edge of your label to the other edge without any white borders. In order to obtain full bleed printing on the QL850, we have to make sure the size of our artwork, template, and the size in the driver are slightly larger than the size of the label. Increase the size by 1 to 2 millimeters for width and length, or 0.04 to 0.08 inches. Let's start with the artwork. First of all, make sure that your artwork is designed correctly for full bleed printing, meaning that there are no white borders around your label artwork. In order to obtain full bleed printing, we have to resize the image to be slightly larger than the size of the label. The amount should be between 0.04 to 0.08 inches. In this example, we're going to print on a label that's 4 by 6 inches. Therefore, we'll set the size of the image to 4.04 by 6.04. We can now close the artwork file and open CQL Pro Advanced Labeling Software. Click Create New Label. Select the QL850 and set the width to 4.04 inches and the length to 6.04 inches. Import your label artwork into the label. You can see the size of the artwork under Field Properties. Center your artwork on the label. Then click File and then Print. Select the Quick Label QL850 printer from the drop down here. Now click the Add button to create a new profile that has the printer and label properties that you want. We'll name the printer profile 4x6 Full Bleed Label. We're not going to change the offset for now but you might need to come back later and adjust these settings. Click on Launch Printing Preferences to access the QL850 printer driver. Click on Manage Label to set the size in the driver. Now give the label a name and set the size here as 4.04 .04 by 6.04 .04 inches. You can also make adjustments to the speed here. Now you can go to the Media tab and select Die Cut Label Gap or Reflective. Click OK and save your profile. Print five sample labels and inspect your printed label to ensure that there is no white border on the edge. If you see that the image has to be moved in either direction, you can do that by modifying the profile and adjusting the offset. Increasing the vertical offset moves the image up toward the printer, and decreasing it moves the image down with the print direction. Increasing the horizontal offset moves the image to the right, and decreasing it moves the image to the left. If you still haven't obtained full bleed printing, increase the size of the artwork, the template, and the size in the driver and test again. It's important that you match the artwork, the template, and the size of the driver if you are going to make these adjustments. And that's it! Now you know how to print full bleed on the Quick Label QL850 using CQL Pro Advanced Labeling Software. We hope you found this video helpful. For more video tutorials, please visit our YouTube channel. Thank you very much.